I really like how this mission works. We um, get to directly help people and not just do work for them, but also to interact with them and pray with them. And I love everything about this place. The fact that people that we've helped in the past continue to can help themselves and help this this community and uh, it sort of builds it builds on itself and it's just a it's a nice thing a lot of times in regular life back home when you're you know you've got your job and your family um and responsibilities it's good to kind of step aside from all of that um and really take this not only as a, as a work mission as a mission to share the gospel of jesus christ with people if that comes up um but also um, almost as a Sabbath, as a retreat for ourselves. They start every day with a, with a devotion here, which is always meaningful. Prayers for every meal. They ask us at the end of each day, what was your God moment? So like, it, it really does help you focus on how God is moving here. Um, and, and it does make you think too about how God is moving back home. I definitely feel like I've grown uh, as a servant of the Lord because before today, I've only ever done, you know, a few various projects helping out. Um, but this has definitely been a really good opportunity to do service uh, for God, to, you know, bring glory to Him through work for His children. My favorite thing? Definitely the people here. Uh, everyone is just really awesome. They're all very helpful. And nobody is, you know, short-tempered when you don't know how to do something or um, anything like that. They're very patient with helping you figure out how to do it. Um, they give you different opportunities to grow as a, a worker. You know, it's, it's awesome. And they're, everyone's just been really great so far. Overall experience has been such a blessing. Um, helping people out who are in need. It's just, it's, it's an amazing experience knowing that the Lord has blessed me with what I have, whether it be time, money, strength, and I can use those, those tools to help others who are in need and it, it blesses me too, as, as, as well as the people I've been working with. I've grown, especially with uh, having a lot of teens here from the church that are with us, it's actually helped give me patience working with them because they don't know, uh, they don't have all the knowledge that I do about working on stuff, so it's given me patience to be able to slow down a little bit and then show them and teach them what we're doing and why we're doing what we're doing so then they can they can experience that. It is beyond comprehension how you sit at home in a nice suburban neighborhood and hear people complain about life and complain about this and that. And you come here to help people that are, you know, widows or orphans or just plain broke and have very little money and are, are barely surviving and they're just the most wonderful and grateful people. It really does help you kind of step back, step back and and think about gratitude.